Start recording. Stop recording button. Hey guys, what's up? It's Justin Reagan here with my, I think it's maybe my second YouTube video, third. I do know I removed a couples because they were like, you know, lame. So anyway, let's get right to it. I've got a uh, new device. I will show you here in a second here. Um, that I will briefly show y'all. Um, and it's on, I do, uh, it's a f cell phone, it's a smartphone, it's, it runs on Android, and it's, I got it right now on T-Mobile, and that's what I bought it through, and it's called the LG Aristo, um, and want to let everybody know now I am visually impaired I can't really see too well so you might hear a lot of my stuff talking in any of my videos so fair warning <laughs> anyway let's get right to it so wow I get it ready here it is so, right there it is, as you can see. Got it in my hand here. It's pretty good size. It's almost as big as a uh, Galaxy S6 or an S5. Um, or the uh, Samsung Galaxy J7. Um... Now, one of the things here, I will show you, um, there's no home, physical home button, but it does have a home button, but it's virtual. Um, and then on the back here, you have the camera, a light, and very oddly, the power button. So, <clears throat> Now, I have a tempered glass on here because being visually impaired, uh, you tend to drop stuff more frequently. So, anyway, also you have the volume rocker switch on the left hand side. And then here on the very bottom of it, you have your. Um, your, uh, your audio output, your charging, and a microphone. Now, this is, like I said, the LG 15G. And, or, not the LG 15G. It's the <laughs> LG Aristo. It's um, tech specs. You get a front camera which is 5 megapixel a back camera which is 13 megapixel and the good real awesome thing about that 13 megapixel is that it can shoot in 1080p high uh, high definition so that'd be good for anybody who's shooting video now um So, without further ado, I'll, uh, you will hear it talk because, like I said, visually, I'm visually impaired. I can't see. So, I'm going to just show you. 10.36 a.m. As you can hear. With Back. all Androids Device nowadays. Oh. Um, thank goodness uh, Google Screen has made a screen reader for Android and so <clears throat> and by the way this has a quad core um please don't quote me on this but from what I 
red. It has a quad core Qualcomm Snapdragon. Um, 1.4 gigahertz uh, or gigs of RAM or 1.5 gigs of RAM and a 1.4 GHZ of of um power of the uh, of the quad core Qualcomm Snap, uh, Snapdragon and you get 16 gigs of onboard memory with the capability of a SD card up to 32 gigs. So, I will say for someone who is visually impaired, you do get your money's worth with this phone. You really do. There's a lot of stuff that's accessible, and with Talk Back On, it's very, uh, I, I, uh, it's very good. It it doesn't slow down. Screen two All the three. gestures are up to date. Screen three and three. I can, you know, with me not being able to see, I can Snapchat. use right. it. Custom actions uninstalled. To my fu uh, fullest ability, I can. Double tap and hold to long press. I can I can use it so that is good and anybody who's blind can can use that it also has capabilities for other um, disabilities um, such as hearing or if you're just low vision or you need different uh, contrast as in um, high contrast or low contrast or Enlarge of text and textiles, or li large, medium, or small icons. It, it's really adaptable to your disability, which is really good. Um, Phone, one new event. So, custom actions, move item, double tap to activate. Double tap and hold to long What press. I meant uh, early, a little bit earlier, I said that it had a virtual uh, home button is right home button. there. There's Double the virtual home button. Double There's no and... physical home button. And to the left of that is the back, back, uh, back button. And then to the right of the uh, virtual Overview home button, button is overview. Tap Which means tap um, all press. your running apps, um, you can go in. Um, some apps will allow simultaneous um, being simultaneous opened. Which means that you can probably check your email and watch a YouTube video at the same time. So it can do multitasking pretty pretty well now with me being visually impaired I don't need that so back button and only certain apps can do uh, is capable of doing that and that uh, and that list is growing by by the day so now this is running the latest version of Android uh, um, which is uh, Android 7.0 um, nougat so, I got this on sale on T-Mobile. Um, it was on sale for $96. Um, the original price, uh, full price, is $120, which is still not bad for, supposedly, they call it a low-end phone, but I say that it just, it, it's really good for for what it is, and the price was really really good. But this is just the basic review. So if you want me to go more in depth, please leave any comments. Please leave comments um, or questions. Um, 
hit the like button if you uh, like this video and you want to see more. Or also hit that subscribe button. Uh, and I'm trying to put more videos out there. So that's it for this uh, for this uh, video. So everybody, I hope you have a wonderful day and happy Easter. Stop recording button. Peace, everyone.